Greetings fellow Dragon Ball fans and collectors, I'm the DBZ Collector and this is the Master Lease Super Dragon Ball Hero Saga Prize C Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Gogeta from Bandai Spirits and Bandai Namco. He was released on November 20th, 2020 and I got him from Amazon. Link in the description box below as well as links to other places you can buy this figure. Before we get to the figure, we're going to the box first. Here is the front, one side, the back, the other side, the bottom, the top, and the Toei Animation sticker, which is this figure's sticker of authenticity. Let you know that he is ruined on a bootleg. And now on to the figure. Alrighty then, here he is out of the box. He comes whole. And he has a support that goes around his ankle. And he stands at 11 and a quarter inches, a very nice size figure. Without the ankle support, he weighs one pound, 4.6 ounces, almost one and a half pounds. Bandai Spirits did a fantastic job with this figure. From head to toe, the sculpt looks fantastic. And I think they did a good job in capturing his likeness. It looks like his anime counterpart. Not the best looking Gogeta, but I think it looks better than some of the other Master Lease Gogeta figures. I would rate this Gogeta a little bit lower than the Extreme Saiyan Gogeta and the Grandista Gogeta. And I would rate him higher than the Master Lease, the 20th film Gogeta and the Master Lease Dragon Ball vs. Omnibus Gogeta. Spirits also did a good job with the coloring. It looked accurate to the anime in my opinion. Although I'm pretty sure the color of his belt and the wrap around his ankles are supposed to be the same shade of blue. The paint quality and application look good as well. And they got some shading throughout the figure. They got on the front side. And since it's an Ichiban Kuji figure, they got shading on the back side. There's no shading on his hair. But there is shading on his skin and on the yellow part of his vest. The shading on the skin is subtle, which I like. I like subtle shading. There is some light orange shading in contrast with the yellow part of his vest on the outside and inside, which indicates that there's less light on that part of the vest as opposed to the yellow part. And you got some shading on his belt and his pants. There's no shading on his shoes in this part right here and none on the black part of his vest or his wristbands. And now for some figure comparisons. Here is compared to the Super Saiyan God Zeno Future Trunks from the same Ichiban Kuji Lottery and the Super Master Stars piece Van Presto World Figure Colosseum Super Saiyan 4 Goku. And here is compared to the Master Lease Extreme Saiyan, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Gogeta, and Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegito. And here he is compared to the Grandista, Resolution of Soldiers, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Gogeta, and the Super Master Stars Peace, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Gogeta. And here he is compared to the Dragon Ball Legends collab, Super Saiyan Goku, and the Master Lease. 
the greatest Saiyan, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And here is compared to the Master Lease, the 20th film, Super Saiyan Gogeta. And the first King Cluster, Full Power Super Saiyan Broly. This is the uh, last one version. Here he is compared to the Master Lease, Dragon Ball vs. Omnibus, Kid Buu. And the Chokoku by Yudin, Full Power Super Saiyan Broly. And here he is compared to the Maximatic, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku. And the Solid Edge Works, The Departure, Volume 1, Goku, and Super Saiyan Goku. And if there are any other figures you want me to compare them to, then let me know in the comment section below. And I'll reply back as soon as possible with an image of the comparison. Some comparisons might take longer to get to, because sometimes YouTube doesn't notify me of every comment. Alrighty, then that concludes this review. If you enjoyed it, Go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down. But I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have this figure, then let me know in the comment section below your thoughts and opinions on them. Even if you don't have them, let me know what you think based on what you see in this video. And if you'd like to buy this figure, and as I mentioned earlier, in the description box below, you will find links of places that sell him. Thank you for watching, and have a nice day.